day. Money, power, respect. Three the hard way. To three the hard way TV. I'm Dion. I'm in here with the fellas Larry, Real, Tommy, Jeff. On today's show, we're gonna uh, discuss something you know that people always think about. We're gonna put it out there. But y'all got any questions, any emails, anything for us? Email as well as the phone numbers below. Y'all can get at us with whatever you got. But on today's show, we're talking about as heterosexual men, it, it happens a lot. Why are some heterosexual men uncomfortable? around homosexual men. What what makes this happen, man? You know what I'm saying? Shit, I, all I can see really in that situation is if, if, if another man make you uncomfortable because he like what he like, is it's something going on with you. Bro. Right. No. What, what you mean, bro? No, like, no, no. Like it, you, what you so insecure because I'm not insecure. I don't like that. I don't, like like right. right. don't want to hang around no motherfucking sport fighter. I didn't say you. <laughs> who said you had to hang around? I don't want to be around them. Well, I mean, like, who was you, you to judge, judge right. somebody? Right. Judge somebody. Who was you? Hey, it's just shit. I'm judging. What I mean, I want to be around. I'm gauging what I want to be around. Hey, that's just like saying that we grew up with a nigga that who might be gay. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. He came out and told us that he gay. Mm -hmm. Right. So you gonna stop being his friend? Hell yeah. No. No, nah, bro. You just no. wanna have a real. See, bro. like, bro. You so first, real, first, I think I think we gotta break it down like this. Like, with 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 the gay man, it's two of them. It's the feminine one, yeah, and then, and then the, it's the regular yeah. dude. Now I think we got more problems with the feminine yeah. dude, yeah. and then it's the then it's the down low. <laughs> 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 so I, I think there's more problem with the dude that's uh like feminine, like because naturally we just don't hang with girls. You know what I'm saying? You you fuck with your girl, but you don't hang with girls. And this dude that's trying to be extra feminine, it just ain't. It's uncomfortable to see a dude like that. Like we had an uncle that was gay. You know what I'm saying? Uh, TV them people. You know what I'm saying? He wasn't like that. He was a regular dude, but he wasn't dressing up in no. women clothes and makeup. That shit was uncomfortable. Like. Exactly. To see. Exactly. To see. Because I ain't got no problem with no dude being gay or no girl. I don't like it when the girl go overboard and want to be a dude. Yeah. But still. Now, if you want to break it down like that. Yeah, that's what I think it is. And it's not yeah. that you don't like it. That's the main thing that makes me uncomfortable because I feel like if you are if you a man and you like men, just dress like a man. Right. And like men don't dress like a woman because that's what a confusion yeah. comes in. And if because then my son is asking me, is well, that a man? Well. And I gotta explain it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. What it is, and like I say, he dress like a girl. So by naturally, like we all we all came up, you know what I'm saying? We ain't hang with girls. So if an outside dude oh, I ain't hang with girls, bro. He ain't hang with no girls. I hang with girls. <laughs> Hoes, yeah. bitches, uh, girls, women, <laughs> women nah, I get what all you're saying. Go ahead with the story, bro. All right, but listen, let me give you a crazy statistic. Hold on, hold on, hold on. No, no, no. We gonna stay on the subject. Let me give you a crazy statistic. All right. A what? A crazy statistic, and this okay. is some real shit. Look it up. Ninety-five percent of all homosexual men have been molested when they was children, and when they that's got not true. That's Look it up. Ninety-five. That's not true. Look, that's it, look at the fuck up. Not true, bro. It's a, it's a so, factual statistic. But what if you got to say? Listen, listen. Let me finish what I'm saying. Let me finish what I'm saying. Right. And wait a minute. Let me finish what I'm saying. And and statistically, eighty percent of them repeat that shit. Right. Okay. I don't like homosexual men. Period. I'm not hanging bro. around homosexual men, and I'm sorry for their circumstances to be what they is. I'm not comfortable hey, around what's, homosexual. What's, what's, what's you, what? Hold on, was you one of the guys that was uh? No, like, I wasn't, motherfucker. Like, don't ask me that shit like that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You want to start it back? You want to have the first fight with the hard white TV nigga? Hell no. Hey, so you saying not, that? So you saying like you don't want the homosexual man around because of what a possibility that he might do? It's is I don't want. I'm not comfortable with right with the homosexual. Okay, no, 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 no. Why would you be uncomfortable? What would make you so uncomfortable that you could not sit next to a homosexual man in a room? Because he gay. Now, other than that, that's not a reason. Right. Because it's obvious he's gay. He's like looking at you what? or he yes. take advantage of it's you. Or, very, or, so so could you hang around? Is this like a very good girl? True story. True story. I, I, I grew up with a motherfucker who was gay. I, we didn't know he was gay until our senior high school. 
When I found out he was gay, I'm not hanging with that nigga. See, but that's something, that's something wrong with you. No, that's not wrong with him. You hung with him. No, it's not. You hung with him the whole life. I'm not hanging with him. I ain't saying you gotta hang out with him. I'm not hanging. I'm not associating with him. I mean, that's like, I ain't associating with him, but I ain't. Your lifestyle different than mine now. Did I know that you gay? We ain't got nothing to talk about, Joe. Just but, but he was the same dude before you knew he was gay. No, but he's not, nigga. Not everybody everybody knows you you, you making gay. his lifestyle no, now. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? No, you doing that. I'm not, no, like, no. Hey, look. You, you say what the said, fuck y'all want to say. Said, I'm not fucking around hey, bro. and hanging with no gay motherfuckers. You said, I'm saying. I'm saying. Hold on, bro. Hold on. You said you was his friend. So how long would you say his friend before you found out he was gay? 12 years. Shit. Shit, from motherfucking fifth grade all the way up to senior year. That's okay, crazy. so how will you how will you turn your back on this guy who he always been who he was? He was so, so no, he always that was who you know. he that always was who he was, bro. You changed this to a different person because you decided. Right here you go, right here. Don't even yeah. answer. Right here you go, right here. Just what you were saying. What if your son was gay? Shit, my son was gay. Live your life. But you done so with you, you kind of well stuff. I'm a, I love the shit out of him, but nigga, I'm not associated. There's three things you can't come back from, nigga. Being gay, snitch, and a fucking police officer. I'm not fucking with him. Because you, 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 you not showing your emotions. So that's not my exactly. pride. That's, that's your pride. pride. That's, that's, that's what he was taught. That dudes just don't have that. That ain't that ain't that, that, like that, that just ain't like that, that just ain't. You'll cut yourself out. Say that. Go ahead. I mean, I still love my. I can't say that. Say it. Say it. Just like me, bro. Like when I found out my nephew was gay. Yeah. That hurted me, bro. But at the end of the day, that's my nephew. That's your nephew. You know what I'm saying? I gotta respect how he is and how he grown up. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. And that's his life. That's what he chose. And I love him to death. And I'm gonna always be there because I'm his uncle, bro. And that's like something. So right okay. now, right now, if I denounce black women and say I only like white women, they better than black women. Would you stop fucking with me? I'm gonna slap the shit out you first. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, hey, that's crazy. Hey, 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 you that's crazy. Well, you gonna get this shit slapped out of you twice. I ain't gonna smack him. I mean, he like who he like. No, I'm talking about who you like. But you're not here in the band. So you can like who you like. I mean, that's who you like. You like him. Coming off like fucking. What's his name? If I say black women ain't shit, who's about to judge him for that? Now, you call out. Now, you said that. You told me. You said your mama ain't shit. I only. No, I'm saying, but to you. But I'm saying, you saying your mama. Cause I'm trying to see where where yo where like, your I like look I got three I got three gay cousins though right do you, you know still is I, they still your they, cousins they, they my cousins did you they just like the house and I don't they not my cousins at all you don't hang with them but you still talk yeah I talk to them hang out with them all that shit because you know they not gonna try to ask exactly that's that's what it is that's what it is bro that's what it is. Nothing to do with that shit. And right. you got a lot to do with that. That's the difference between your cousin and your gay than outside of being gay. It's no difference, bro. I don't like them being gay. 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 You said you hang with your gay cousin. What's the difference between your gay cousin? I don't have a fucking problem. They gay cousin, they like that. They have a problem. So you going to cut them off because they being gay? No, I'm not. I ain't really like you. know, That's my cousin. Now that's cool. No, we talking about your. You were talking about your 25 year homie. But you just said that's cool. You just said him off. You said something. My cousins? No, I'm saying. My you got the that you why is you uncomfortable around gay men? No, I'm not uncomfortable, bro. Mm -hmm. Because I, I look, I like women and they'll like I, I you know I got a gay homie, you know what I'm saying? I talk to him, he hit my line there once in a while, I talk to him, he just talk about life and shit like that. He cool, he be with his gay dude or whatever the fuck the case may be. But I told him, you know, from the get-go, bro, like, I'm not here to judge you. That's your motherfucking lifestyle. Yeah. You do what you gotta do. Exactly. You can still hit me on the line. We can talk, all that shit, bro. I'm not into that shit, bro. Because right. when, when it's all said and done, we get to where we gonna go. Another motherfucker standing there to judge us to begin with. That ain't exactly. my motherfucking that's, job. That's bro. just like, okay, look, let me give you, let me, let me tell you. My, one of my, one of my gay cousins. I got a lot of other shit came, to worry about. live with me, exactly. okay? That's for a few months, though. Yeah. All right, now I got my my my, my girl, mm -hmm. my daughter. Hey, uh, so, uh, he lived with you for how long? Six months. What's his favorite song? Is Randy Man? I I don't fucking know. What's <laughs> that? <laughs> but the Did one thing I told him, him but the one thing I told him though, you know what I'm saying? I don't care about you being gay. You know, I know you come live with me, all that shit. 
Mm-hmm. Once you cross into my door, that gay shit is out the door. No. Yeah, I got the Don't bring that, that shit like, in my yeah, house. Bring it in your you know what I'm saying? I got my. That's under your rules. Is your rules? You know my girl? We got a, we got a 13, 14 year old. I got a 14 yeah, year old. Teenage son awesome. in this motherfucker. Yeah, and I don't want you influencing his mindset. Nor do I want you to fight, motherfucker. Having him having any knowledge of you being gay whatsoever. So you know what I'm saying? Let him make his choice on what he wants. A gay man never made a pass at you. No. Something going on that side. Have you, ever, have you ever been gay for a second like Jamie Foxx? Yeah. <laughs> 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 when you say young girl, you was gay for a second. No, that, no, no, I ain't never looked at Prince and thought I was gay. I thought, any man. I thought I'd be cool. You might have to be. But I didn't that never think I was gay. Right right you probably looked at him like, that nigga Mar got some caramel smooth skin. Shit happens. No, but I never. Shit happens. I mean, no, you know that I look at you all. You know that like, post that you got a man there on your cellar and you look up to us? Man, you get the fuck out of here. I'm blowing his house up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I told Miss Perry he got a post on the cellar to us. I'm blowing your hey, cellar. Hey, YouTube, YouTube, <laughs> Facebook, man. Uh, y'all leave those comments below. Y'all let Tommy know if he's wrong. Is 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 the wrong way of thinking, or is Tommy entitled to his opinion? You know what I'm saying? Like like me and Mob said, and and I don't know if they agree with it. If you're gonna be gay, be gay. But dressing like the opposite sex yeah. of being gay is, is confusing to me. Yeah, it's confusing yeah. to me too. I, I'm, yeah. Just, yeah. I, I'm not with that, but I'm not gonna judge like, no motherfucker. I, I don't I'm not gonna judge. But it's my friend. Keep that. If you like my friend, I cut off. Man, just keep that all life. But I never knew that shit. So you wasn't a real friend to me, no way. Why? He was just trying to scare you. No, 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 no. I can see what he's saying. You were his real friend. He know what. You know what I'm saying? If you, if you, if you didn't tell me you was gay from the get go, you know what I'm saying? Because Tommy, Tommy, this is the thing though. That was gonna happen regardless. This is your reaction now, right? You, you gonna call? You the judge? No, that's just the same thing. If 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 you cheating on your motherfucking girl, what you go out and tell you cheating? That's totally different. How is that totally different? Exactly. Because you're not a real boy. You're not a real boy. To you, you hear me? Fucking just I was just fucking them girls. I was gonna get them yeah. right back. <laughs> <laughs> but you don't know, nigga. I, I I spilled the tea on myself. You know what I'm saying, motherfucker? Yeah, I got caught. It was hot. Cause I didn't get it. Look at the tea on See right there. My girl can catch you. You said spill the tea. Now she cut you off. Women know what she cut you off. our fan page on Facebook. Also subscribe to the YouTube. Don't forget to like and share this video. Comment under the link. It's your boy Real. Hey, I love you motherfuckers, okay? And I know y'all see the ladies looking good in them three the highway TV hey, shirts. Three, <laughs> the highway T. <laughs> 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 Y'all hit that subscribe button for y'all chance to win official three to hallway TV gear. I don't know if y'all gonna be able to make those shirts look as good as the ladies got them looking. Oh, <laughs> shut up.